Hello, friends. The human brain, the most complex organ in the body, has long been a subject of fascination and study. Recently, scientists have begun exploring a revolutionary idea that quantum mechanics, the fundamental theory governing the behavior of particles at the smallest scales, might play a crucial role in brain function. This groundbreaking field, known as quantum neuroscience, seeks to uncover how quantum effects could influence cognition, consciousness, and the mysteries of the human mind. With the potential to transform our understanding of how we think and perceive the world, quantum neuroscience is the new frontier in brain research. At the heart of quantum mechanics lies the concept that particles can exist in multiple states simultaneously, a phenomenon known as superposition, Additionally, particles can become entangled, meaning the state of one particle is directly related to the state of another, no matter the distance between them. These principles are not just limited to the microscopic world, but could also be playing a crucial role in the functioning of the human brain. One theory suggests that neurons, the cells that transmit information throughout the brain, might operate using quantum superposition. In classical neuroscience, neurons are thought to either be firing or not, similar to a binary system of ones and zeros. However, in a quantum brain, neurons might exist in multiple states at once, allowing for a vastly more complex and nuanced form of information processing. Quantum entanglement could also provide a mechanism for the remarkable connectivity and synchronization observed in brain activity. If neurons are entangled, the state of one neuron could instantly influence the state of another, potentially explaining how different parts of the brain communicate so rapidly and effectively. This could also be a basis for phenomena such as intuition and the rapid, seemingly inexplicable connections our brains sometimes make. Another quantum effect, known as tunneling, allows particles to pass through barriers that would be insurmountable in classical physics. This could play a role in how signals traverse the synaptic gaps between neurons, speeding up communication and enhancing brain efficiency. Quantum tunneling might also explain how certain neurotransmitters are released and received, adding another layer of complexity to brain function. Quantum coherence, the ability of particles to act in a coordinated way might be crucial for maintaining the delicate balance needed for conscious thought. Coherence ensures that the quantum states within neurons are stable and can interact constructively rather than destructively, which is essential for coherent thought processes and awareness. If quantum effects are indeed significant in brain function, this could have profound implications for our understanding of cognitive processes. Memory formation, learning, perception, and decision-making could all be influenced by quantum mechanics, leading to new ways of enhancing cognitive abilities and treating neurological disorders. Despite the exciting possibilities, the idea of quantum effects in the brain is not without its challenges and controversies. The brain is a warm, wet environment which traditionally has been considered unsuitable for maintaining quantum states. However, recent research suggests that biological systems might be more adept at harnessing quantum mechanics than previously thought. To validate the theories of quantum neuroscience, researchers are developing experiments to detect quantum effects in biological systems. Advances in technology, such as ultra-sensitive measurement tools and quantum computing, are aiding these efforts. Future research will focus on identifying specific quantum mechanisms in the brain and understanding how they contribute to neural processes. The potential applications of quantum neuroscience are vast. From developing new treatments for mental health disorders and neurodegenerative diseases, to creating advanced artificial intelligence systems that mimic the quantum nature of the brain, the possibilities are endless. Understanding quantum effects in the brain could lead to breakthroughs in brain-machine interfaces, enhancing human cognitive abilities, 
and even paving the way for mind-to-mind -mind communication. These specific experiments highlight the innovative approaches scientists are taking to explore the potential role of quantum mechanics in brain function. By studying quantum coherence, tunneling, entanglement, and their applications in cognition and perception, researchers are uncovering new dimensions of how the brain works. As technology advances, we can expect even more exciting discoveries in this groundbreaking field. One of the foundational experiments in quantum neuroscience involves detecting quantum coherence in microtubules, which are tiny structures within neurons. Researchers use advanced techniques like nuclear magnetic resonance and electron spin resonance to detect quantum states within microtubules. These techniques measure the alignment and behavior of particles at the quantum level within the brain's microtubules. Some studies have reported observing quantum coherence in microtubules at physiological temperatures, which was previously thought to be impossible. This supports the theory that quantum processes could play a role in brain function, particularly in information processing and consciousness. Another experiment focuses on the role of quantum tunneling in synaptic transmission, the process by which neurons communicate with each other. Researchers simulate the synaptic environment and measure electron tunneling between neurotransmitter molecules and receptor sites. Advanced microscopy and spectroscopy techniques are used to observe these tiny, fast processes. Evidence suggests that quantum tunneling could facilitate the rapid transmission of signals across synapses. This might explain the high efficiency and speed of neural communication, which is essential for brain function. To investigate quantum entanglement in brain waves, scientists conduct experiments to see if entangled particles can influence brain activity. Researchers use electroencephalography to measure brain waves while manipulating entangled particles in controlled conditions. Experiments often involve pairs of entangled photons or electrons to see if changes in one particle affect brain activity. Preliminary results indicate that changes in entangled particles can correlate with changes in brain wave patterns. This suggests that entanglement could be a mechanism for the rapid synchronization of neural networks. The quantum theory of smell proposes that quantum tunneling helps us detect different odors. Experiments aim to test this hypothesis by examining how olfactory receptors respond to various molecules. Researchers expose olfactory receptors to different odorant molecules and measure the resulting electrical signals. Quantum mechanical models are used to predict which molecules will cause tunneling and therefore be detected by the receptors. Results support the idea that quantum tunneling helps distinguish between similar smelling molecules. This adds to our understanding of how quantum effects can influence sensory perception. Interviews with leading scientists provide valuable insights into how quantum mechanics might influence brain function. Sir Roger Penrose, a renowned physicist, has been a significant proponent of the idea that quantum mechanics plays a role in consciousness. Penrose, along with Stuart Hameroff, proposed the orchestrated objective reduction theory. During an interview, Penrose explained how microtubules within neurons might support quantum computations. He emphasized that classical physics cannot fully explain the complexity of consciousness and that quantum processes could provide the necessary framework. Penrose highlighted that the coherence observed in microtubules at body temperature supports their theory, suggesting a biological system capable of sustaining quantum states. Stuart Hameroff, an anesthesiologist, co-developed the orc or theory with Penrose. In his interview, Hameroff described how anesthesia affects consciousness by potentially disrupting quantum processes in microtubules. He shared his observations on how anesthetic agents might interfere with quantum coherence, leading to loss of consciousness. Hameroff's clinical experiences and research support the idea that quantum mechanics is crucial for maintaining conscious awareness.
He emphasized the need for interdisciplinary collaboration to explore these theories further. Matthew Fisher, a physicist from the University of California, Santa Barbara, has proposed that certain brain processes might involve quantum computation. Fisher's research focuses on how nuclear spins, tiny magnetic moments in atomic nuclei, could function as qubits in the brain. In his interview, Fisher discussed the potential role of phosphorus nuclear spins in neurons, suggesting that they could form a quantum memory system. He explained the biological plausibility of such a system and how it could influence cognitive functions. Fisher's work bridges the gap between theoretical physics and practical neuroscience. Anurban Bandiopadhyay, a scientist at the National Institute for Material Science in Japan, has conducted extensive research on quantum biology. Quantum neuroscience technologies raise significant ethical questions. Privacy concerns arise if these technologies enable mind-reading capabilities, potentially compromising mental privacy. Individuals' mental privacy could be compromised, leading to potential misuse of such technology by governments, corporations, or malicious actors. Safeguarding mental privacy will be essential to prevent invasive surveillance and ensure that individuals' thoughts remain private. The application of quantum neuroscience in medical treatments and cognitive enhancement must consider patients' consent and autonomy. Patients should have the right to make informed decisions about undergoing treatments that involve quantum-based technologies. The complexity of quantum neuroscience might make it challenging for individuals to fully understand the implications of such treatments. Ensuring clear communication and obtaining explicit consent will be critical to respecting patient autonomy. Quantum neuroscience technologies may be expensive and complex, potentially limiting access to a privileged few. This raises concerns about equity and fairness in healthcare and cognitive enhancement. If only a select group can benefit from these advancements, it could exacerbate existing social and economic inequalities. Developing strategies to make these technologies accessible to a broader population will be necessary to promote fairness and inclusivity. Quantum neuroscience could lead to significant cognitive enhancements, improving memory, learning, and decision-making. While this has positive potential, it also raises ethical questions about human enhancement. There is a risk that cognitive enhancement could create a societal divide between those who can afford these technologies and those who cannot. Additionally, the pressure to enhance cognitive abilities might lead to new forms of social coercion or discrimination against those who choose not to undergo enhancement. Advances in quantum neuroscience could challenge our understanding of personal identity and consciousness. If we can manipulate or enhance cognitive functions at a quantum level, it might alter individuals' sense of self. This raises philosophical and ethical questions about the nature of identity and what it means to be human. Ensuring that these technologies do not undermine personal identity or lead to unintended psychological consequences will be crucial. Quantum neuroscience research generates vast amounts of data about brain function and cognition. Ensuring the ethical use and storage of this data is paramount. Quantum computing offers unparalleled processing power, making it valuable for brain research by simulating neural networks and analyzing brain activity data. Traditional computers struggle with the complex calculations required to model brain function, but quantum computers can handle these tasks more efficiently. Researchers use quantum computing to simulate neural networks, analyze brain activity data, and develop new theories about brain function. This approach accelerates the pace of discovery and leads to more accurate models of how the brain works. Quantum sensors provide highly sensitive and precise measurements, crucial for brain imaging technologies. These sensors can detect minute changes in magnetic fields and other parameters, offering a clearer picture of brain activity. Quantum-enhanced magnetic resonance, imaging, and magnetoencephalography 
are examples of how quantum sensors improve our ability to visualize and understand brain processes. These advancements lead to better diagnosis and treatment of neurological disorders. The sensitive nature of brain data demands robust security measures. Quantum cryptography offers a solution by providing virtually unbreakable encryption. This technology uses the principles of quantum mechanics to secure data transmission, ensuring that brain research data remains confidential and protected from unauthorized access. Quantum cryptography is particularly important for protecting personal information in medical records and research databases. Quantum theories are also influencing the development of artificial intelligence. Quantum algorithms can process information in ways that classical algorithms cannot, leading to more advanced AI systems. These systems can mimic brain function more closely, improving their ability to learn, make decisions, and adapt to new information. Quantum AI has applications in various fields, including healthcare, where it can assist in diagnosing diseases, personalizing treatments, and predicting patient outcomes. Understanding quantum effects in the brain helps researchers develop more effective drugs for neurological and psychiatric conditions. By studying how quantum mechanics influences brain function, scientists can identify new drug targets and design medications that interact with the brain at the quantum level. This approach leads to treatments with higher efficacy and fewer side effects, improving patient outcomes. Quantum theories are inspiring the development of advanced brain-computer interfaces. These devices allow direct communication between the brain and external systems, enabling new forms of interaction and control. Quantum-enhanced BCIs offer higher precision and responsiveness, benefiting individuals with disabilities and providing new ways to interact with technology. Applications range from controlling prosthetic limbs to enhancing cognitive functions. Research into quantum neuroscience is leading to technologies that can enhance cognitive abilities. By understanding how quantum processes contribute to brain function, scientists are developing methods to boost memory, learning, and problem-solving skills. These enhancements could benefit education professional training and personal development, helping individuals reach their full potential. Quantum mind mapping is an emerging technique that uses quantum principles to map out the brain's complex network of connections. This approach provides a more detailed and accurate representation of how different brain regions interact. Quantum mind mapping helps researchers understand the brain's structure and function leading to new insights into cognition, behavior, and neurological diseases. Quantum neuroscience represents a bold new direction in brain research, promising to unlock the mysteries of cognition and consciousness through the lens of quantum mechanics. These advancements hold tremendous promise, but also present significant ethical challenges. Addressing issues of privacy, consent, equity, personal identity, data use, and dual-use concerns will be crucial as we move forward. By exploring quantum coherence, tunneling, entanglement, and their applications in cognition and perception, researchers are uncovering new dimensions of how the brain works. As technology advances, we can expect even more exciting discoveries in this groundbreaking field. Thank you for joining us on this journey through quantum effects in the brain. Please like, comment and share the video, and please do not forget to subscribe for more videos.